Man, oh man, what a surprise from the uh, WWE's Royal Rumble 2019. Becky Lynch, the man, proves that she's able to get it done winning the Royal Rumble. She's now going to be going to WrestleMania, more than likely facing Ronda Rousey. Now, I go from the earlier question of wondering why Ronda Rousey, or I'm sorry, why Becky Lynch lost to Asuka earlier in the night and wondering what she was going to do at WrestleMania. Now I'm wondering what Charlotte's going to do at WrestleMania. I'm guessing that you could easily do the rematch from last year's WrestleMania. Charlotte versus Asuka. Then we do Rousey versus Lynch. Um, I'm, I'm guessing that's the plan that there's going to be. I guess there's still hope of doing some sort of a three-way between um, Charlotte, Becky, and uh, Ronda. Hopefully finding some way to put sort of put them together um, to answer any questions about how Becky Lynch ended up getting into the WrestleMania, um, into the Royal Rumble to go to WrestleMania. Uh, Lana ended up drawing number 28, and she was injured earlier on the pre-show. Um, she ended up, um, you know, uh, hurting her ankle. Um, she was hobbling her way down to the ring, and uh, she wasn't going to make it. Uh, the next number ended up being called, which was Nia Jax. According to the old school rules, was that if you didn't get in the ring within your two minutes, you were automatically eliminated. Uh, for this year's Rumble, I guess they're going with different rules, where uh, Becky Lynch made her way out after number 30. Um, seeing that Lana was not going to be able to um, be in the contest, begged and begged and begged Fit Finley, who finally just said, go on out there and get it done. Um, you know, uh, Becky ended up getting in there, uh, having one hell of a rumble and actually pulled it off. Um, I thought that it was a good rumble. Honestly, um, when it comes to the Women's Royal Rumbles, I can honestly tell you, I don't think it was as good as last year, but last year had the surprise of a Royal Rumble we had never seen before. Um, so, uh, I think that's what honestly makes it a little bit better, you know, in my mind. But, um, you know, this one to me, honestly, just had a whole lot of girls that I had no clue. There was girls from uh, the uh, May Young uh, tournament. There was girls from NXT. There was one girl that was on American Ninja Warrior. I don't even know if she's in WWE or if she was just some sort of a celebrity um, contestant, but she had some moves. She was honestly was pretty good. She did one of the spots where she walked in her hands. Um, had just about every competitor from Raw and SmackDown uh, on the roster that I can honestly um, think of. Um, so, um, I mean, that's the only drawback because it, it, I think it's my fault, not theirs. There just was a whole lot of people I had never heard of. Rhea Ripley, um, I think I believe I believe is what her name was. She's the UK Women's Champion. I believe that was just crowned. I haven't had a chance to watch any of those shows yet, but I'm sure they're good wrestling shows. So, um, Becky Lynch uh, gets the win in the Rumble. Pretty good moment. I think it's something that we're all going to remember for a long time. So, we'll see what happens with her in WrestleMania.